My lord, I am docked at the space station above Hoth. Very good. Now that Admiral Monk and the War Trust have fallen to your might, all that remains is Jedi Knight Zerinder. Zerinder has dedicated himself to the Republic like no other. He's led our enemies to many cunning victories. Not only is he a symbol of inspiration for the Republic, he's been a thorn in my side for a long time. Do you know what he's trying to achieve here? The Chiss traitor you spared confirmed Zerinder's presence, and has since informed me that the Jedi is seeking a secret superweapon. I can uncover no information about this weapon, only that it was lost in the wreckage of one of the crashed starships from the war. Maybe we can use the Republic's toy against them. Perhaps. If Zerinder wants it, it must be very powerful. His death is the goal, but if the weapon can be salvaged, all the better. Your contact on the surface is Commander Lanklin. He's been tracking Zerinder and should be ready to meet you at the Imperial base. The Commander occasionally bites off more than he can chew, but he's being warned that this mission cannot afford anything less than perfection. Zerinder is the last of your targets. Report to me when you know the nature of the superweapon he seeks. Get this right, Apprentice. Hoth. Back in the day, I managed to escape assignment here. It chills my bones just to be in orbit above this frigid planet. Um, yeah, you should <coughs> leave me on the ship. I'm... <coughs> I think I'm fighting off a cold. <coughs> Forget those cowards, my lord. A little snow won't stop me. I'm ready for action. I too would gladly accompany you on this mission, my lord. I wish to see all the galaxy has to offer. I seek Commander Lanklin. My lord? I am Ensign Slint, Commander Lanklin's second in command. You've arrived sooner than expected. The commander is in the field, tracking Jedi Zerender, but has failed to report in. His tracer beacon hasn't moved for quite some time. I don't like the sound of that. Nor do I. The commander is always punctual. This planet is a pitfall of hazards. There's a massive Republic presence, and all manner of power-hungry alien pirates. Our forces are stretched thin. A rescue party for Commander Lanklin would take several days to put together. Just tell me where to go. Here is the location indicated by the Tracer Beacon. It's in hostile territory. There are rumors of a heavily defended pirate stronghold in that sector. It will be hard to get in. Consider me warned. I hope you are successful, my lord. The pirates hate the Empire. If Commander Lanklin has fallen into their clutches, I hate to think what's happened. My lord, is that you? I heard the sounds of battle outside and grew hopeful. Rise to your feet, Commander. You're freed. Sorry for this trouble, but truth is, my capture gives us great insight into the enemy. Jedi Zerinder is a crafty adversary. I thought I was tracking him and his men when I found myself led into a pirate ambush. It seems he had the Republic's elite Tal's commandos lure me off his trail. The Tal's are unmatched trackers. Highly cunning. Could have happened to anyone. I'm sorry, my lord, but this means I have no concrete leads. I can tell you this. If Zerinder has been given command of the Tal's, this weapon he's after must be supremely important. I know where the Tal's headquarters is located. Maybe you can force one of them to confess what Zerinder's after. Tell me more about the Tal's. They're strong, stealthy, and lethal. Oversized, white, hairy beasts that thrive in the cold. They practically disappear in the snow, so you don't know they're there until they've attacked. I wish you luck against them. Just try not to get captured again. Rest assured, my lord. You won't need to save me again. I hope this lead makes up for my... blunder. I'll rendezvous with you at the outpost in the next sector, and we can update Lord Barris. I'm all that's left. Everywhere I turn, the monster appears. Why do you torment me? I'm not part of your vendetta. What? A Sith? First Zerinder abandons me, now this? I haven't come to kill you. Why should I trust you? You're my sworn enemy. At least a Sith I can see and fight straight up. I won't be assassinated in the dark like these poor Tals. My master would tell me not to attack, but he's not here. Defend yourself, Sith! Bah, go ahead and kill me. I didn't want to die at the hands of the beast anyway. You need to calm down. If you'd seen what I'd seen, you know how foolish that sounds. 
The Tall's warned my master about Brunmark. He's a savage Tall seeking revenge on Fitzellan and the others for ousting him. But did Zarender care? No. Now Brunmark's in here somewhere, murdering. Wait! Did you hear that? No. He's. he's. <laughs> You think killing a defenseless man makes you impressive? I have no quarrel with Fetzellan and the Tals. I have no intention of disrupting you, Brune Mark. This Jedi of my hollow lantern. Now. I I, I can't. Serendor's overridden all my controls. As you can see, Barris, I control this planet. I've tapped your communications and can anticipate your every move. As Commander Lanklin knows firsthand, the Tals keep me one step ahead of even you. I've never seen you speechless, Master. I have. If only I'd taken the opportunity to shut him up permanently. I'm not here for a reunion, Barris. The last time we met, you were left drained and weaponless. This time, you won't be so lucky. My lord... I... I'm sorry, I... You have failed me for the last time, Lankton. Ensign Slint, you are now coordinator of my dealings on Hoth. Don't screw it up, Commander. I will not... Disappoint you, my lord. Apprentice, you better have good news for me. You can always count on me, master. The lost superweapon Zarinder seeks is actually a Jedi master named Wyalet. Ah, Master Wyalet. Now I understand why Zarinder would risk exposure. Before his capture during the war, Wyalet was among the Jedi's most powerful masters. The ship transporting him to me was destroyed in a fierce space battle in this system. I assumed he'd perish, but... The ship must have crashed here on Hoth, and he's kept himself alive all this time. So it would seem. For beings that commune deeply enough, the Force can be as sustaining as rations. During the war, Zerinder was Master Wyalet's Padawan. We battled. Wyalet took my lightsaber and used it from then on. If Wyalet is on Hoth, so is my blade. I will concentrate to locate it. Yes, there. Coordinate sent, Commander. Now go, Apprentice. Find the lightsaber and the Jedi. My lord, the area indicated is an uncharted quadrant where black marketeers are said to operate. What will you have me do while you're away? That's all I need, Commander. The Emperor's speed to you, my lord. Nice price for something we thawed out from the ice. The lightsaber is yours. Glad we could do business together, Tolls. Whatever they're paying, I'll double it. Another interested party. I smell a bidding war. We're open to offers. Triple, huh? Deal. Men, power up your blasters. I have wronged you.
I'm impressed with your skill and strength, Boonmark. <laughs> You've been most helpful. I'm here for the Jedi, not you. Fetzel and might kill you. Then where would I be? <laughs> My lord, by binding the Tals to you, his brutal murdering can be controlled. Kill Fetzelen, and then serve me. Fall in line. I have unfinished business of my own. We are stronger with you along, Brunmark. Welcome. <laughs> Eyes are still adjusting, but I have no trouble recognizing you, Brave Zerander. The sight warms me. Master Wyatt, your ordeal has ended. I only wish I'd heard you reaching out to me sooner. Do not denigrate yourself. It took great concentration to summon you. All these many years, entombed in this rubble. I have fed off the Force, and have great insights to impart. This should be good. I can't wait to hear it. What's this? I sense a presence. Barris. Indeed. This is Darth Barriss's apprentice, come to stop me from returning you to your command. Conserve your strength, Master. My men and I will dispatch this interloper. I seek a peaceful solution. So you realize how drastically outnumbered you are. I see you've managed to tame that sadistic Tolls. It won't help you. To arms, men! Protect Master Wyatt at all costs! Stop, Sith. Had my strength returned before this moment, I would have kept Zerinder from engaging you. Now he is down, and your fight has made this chamber unstable. It is nearing an inevitable collapse. You've proven your superiority. Let me bargain for Zerinder's life. Talk, but make it fast. This fight was unnecessary. I have no intention of returning to fight for the Republic. Zerinder's young and driven, yet he has only begun to grasp the ways of the Force. In truth, I was the same until being buried on Hoth. Here I communed with the Force, to the exclusion of all else. I find that somewhat intriguing. It has been a great privilege. And quite mind-expanding. The Force is with me. Greater than ever now. I suspect that I could defeat you quite handily. But I'm no longer concerned with the tidings of this galaxy. Or these times. I 
only seek to continue my transcendence. If that's true, why did you summon Zerinder here? I wanted to share my revelations, and bring him to the same understanding. This excavation site is nearing collapse. Should we battle, we would both be crushed. Allow Zerinder and me to be buried here for eternity. Your objective will be met. Our lives will be richer. Finding oneness with the Force. I like the sound of that. Then save yourself, and leave this place before the ceiling crashes down. I will protect Zerinder, and prepare myself for the Collapse. You have my gratitude, Sith. A precise lightsaber sweep as you exit will cause the cave-in. you are looking at a very pleased man. Admiral Mutt destroyed. The War Trust, no more. Now, with Jedi Zerinder and Master Wyatt neutralized, all of the Republic's most vaunted leaders are no more. Plan Zero is complete. I'm honored to have had a hand in it. Your contribution will be rewarded far beyond the simple glory of it. There is more to discuss. Much of it of a sensitive nature which I do not wish to convey via hollow. Return to my chambers here on Drummond Cass immediately.